is some summer steelhead. All right, let's go. All right, good morning, guys. Welcome back to Oregon Fishing Adventures. We are out here on the river on that summer steelhead grind. Things are definitely low and clear today. Um, so we're gonna fish this spot first. Just got a little riffle section through here. Um, and we're gonna see if we can find anything. There's a little bit of slower water back there that's a little bit deeper. So we'll pick this apart. Um, my buddy Tony is with me today. He's gonna be down here in just a minute. And then uh, hopefully we can find some fish out here. So we're, let's get the rod set up and start fishing. All right, All right we're gonna go down here and fish a spinner. My buddy's up above me here. So let's see. Put on a size three RMB. Things are definitely low and clear out here today, that's for sure. Still testing out that new rod from uh, Morgan's Custom Rods. But yeah, because it's so low and clear, I'm gonna try to fish these threes. If I get into some deeper water, I'll throw on some fours. Three's definitely getting down here in this water though. Enough that I'm grabbing the algae. All right, guys, some new spots. Let's see if we can find something. <laughs> Snag the drift and set up right off the bat. I saw the smooth. No. Sony just hooked up for a second. There's two fish, two at least two fish, maybe more swimming around in this hole right here. It looked like a pair, it looked like a buck following a hen around. Um, and he just hooked into one. Oh man. All right, you gotta get redemption. I'm over here trying to redo my drifting setup. Oh, we saw these fish. He noticed him first and pointed it out. So he's trying to fish a really long leader over here on these guys. Try to 
be a little bit less uh, noticeable with this bobber. gonna get a new leader on here and my drift setup is good to go all right let's get something going check back in a minute all right we got the drift rod set back up I think they dip back to the tail out maybe. So this is that's my my new game plan. A little 10 mil bead and it's like a molted pattern. And then a little egg ball of yarn with scent. We'll see. gonna get them today at least we know we found fish that's encouraging sign yeah. kind of drifting down there just to see some coffee we got a little breakfast sandwich oh we got two we got one with bacon one with sausage yeah buddy all right we're gonna scale down this and get in this little pocket here is there a spinner rod
fish. Again? Oh, you got it? Give this a shot. So Gonna be some tricky water to land a fish if I catch one though. That's for sure. tied up as well changing colors on the bead changed colors on the jig check this little spot out we kind of move towards the tail out put our polarized glasses on let's hop down a couple rocks here Couple little trout chasing the spinner. Yeah, I mean, there's some nice structure in here. I could see, I mean, even though it is shallow, I could still see a fish sitting in here. So I'm like, it's at least worth the cast before we walk past it.
Definitely no shortage of covering water today though. And there goes and there goes the clouds and here comes the partly cloudy. Other than the water being low and clear, like the weather is pretty perfect today. Yeah. I'm wading up the river. Trying to get to our next spot. Yeah. So you said there's a spot up around the corner? Huh? You said there's a spot around this corner? Yeah, there's another set of roof over here. You probably see it once we hit the street. Around the street. And then uh, above that. Uh-huh. Yep, just adventuring out here. Trying to find us some fishes. It's a cool tree. We're gonna see how far up the river we can make it today. Try this. It looks like a fish would sit in that. No, but I see like there's like a edge. Oh, wrong way. Let's see. There we go. Oh, oh, no way. Fish on. Oh, fish off, bro. It's fucking right there. It's right there in the middle, bro. Oh, no way. Dude, I told you I thought there'd be a fish sitting in there, and that thing's chrome. Chrome, dude. Dang. You didn't see it? I saw your pole, I couldn't see him. Oh man, yeah, that thing is freaking chrome, dude. And it hit right at the end of that slot right there. Right in that little blue rip? Like where there's the there's the disturbed water coming down. Oh. It just break it just barely breaks the surface. 
I was bringing it down right through here. Well guys, we just missed that one in this pool right here behind us. Um, that was a nice fish. It was chrome. I don't know if you guys saw that on camera. Hopefully you did. Um, but we're gonna keep moving up and hopefully we can find another one to play with. So that's pretty encouraging that the second hole up here, we were able to find a fish. So hopefully there's more waiting for us. Let's get going. All right, we got a little trout. Oh, and it's gone. That's funny. I was hooked on a snag. As soon as it came out of the snag, I had a little trout on there. <laughs> Trout. There he goes. There's two trout out of that one little seam there. First one was a little bigger. And that first, the second one was all the way down at the tail out too. Hooked into a steelhead. Landed a trout, hooked into another trout. All right, let's see if I can get a drift through here with the bead. Oh my god, what a... You see that cast, dude? That was perfect. And it's gonna go... Oh, oh, oh. You see that? Oh. Dude, I went right down that slot. Right where it should be. That might work out. Let's see. Is that current gonna pull it out? Maybe not. Maybe not. I guess the way I'm thinking about it right now with it, everything being so low and clear is I'm thinking like when I'm stalking trout, like I don't wanna get ahead of them cause I don't want them to see me. So if I fish from the tail out forward, then they can't see me. As long as I don't just absolutely butcher my cast, then we're Gucci. Yeah, something. We got another trail. Right? I mean, maybe that means I got the right color on. <laughs> Who knows? Let's 
Come on, fish. Let's get the uh, jig out here. Some jiggy jiggy action. He's snagged up. You lose everything? Oh, yep, there goes the slobber. Just this pocket here. This looks super juicy. Oh, come on. Shallowing it up a little bit, huh? Okay. Spot a shot. Drifting off of that rock right there. I'm like drifting that jig right under that rock, dude. All right, Tony's gonna fish this far scene. Looks good, hope he catches something. Good 
Getting a nice drift. Oh. Yeah. All right, guys, just doing a little check-in. So we both have hooked into a fish today. Unfortunately, they both got off. We did catch some trout, so we're definitely not skunked. Uh, we know fish are around, uh, but we just weren't lucky uh, today. We're still gonna fish on our way out, but we're gonna start heading out towards our vehicles. Uh, we've already been out here for, well, we've been up for 12 hours. We've been up here for like 10. Uh, but yeah, so we're gonna get heading out, probably calling it a day, but it was fun just grinding it out, having a good time, and exploring some different water today. So uh, yeah, I will check in when we get to a new spot down the river, and then when we're heading out for the day. All right, heading back. Which way are we gonna go? This way. This way, this way. You gotta navigate the river. You gonna be good stepping down that? Probably. Or I <laughs> So I'm like, should I wait a minute? It's definitely slick. I remember coming through. Okay, cool. Because I remember trying to get up or trying to. Yeah, this is the hard part. if I didn't have my felt on, this would suck. Do you need me to give you a hand? I just gotta take a bigger step. You got it? You got, got it? Go. Okay, cool. Now I got it. Now I'm gonna take a step down that. I remember it was kind of slow because I just slid straight down. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a day though. That's fun though, man. I'm what a day. And it was nice getting out early too. Like, it's, it's awesome. the first first time I I've really gotten out early for for summer steelhead so far other than I, I got out early one morning uh, and went to the other system I'd been fishing but it was time. it was a shorter day for sure yeah, it's about the second time I uh, went this hard for, you know, for a I don't know which way I want to go this way maybe uh, yeah. Smolties. Bunch of smolties. Oops. Alright. Alright guys, we're getting out of here today. Thanks so much for coming along with us. It was an awesome day on the water hanging out with my buddy Tony and uh, we covered a lot of water today guys like wow it is uh, definitely probably the most water that I've covered in a single day up here uh, definitely fished some spots that I was already familiar with as well as fish some new spots that I haven't been to before so it was an awesome time he hooked into a fish I hooked into a fish fortunately we both lost them heartbreaker guys freaking heartbreaker we're so close both of us are just grinding away for these summer steelhead and we both want one so bad we thought today was going to be the day but they slipped away either way we didn't get skunked though we did both get a fish uh we both caught some trout um and it was an awesome day out here guys like the weather was great it's partly cloudy in the afternoon and it was cloudy in the morning uh so really had a great time uh we're gonna get out here again soon keep trying keep grinding and we'll see you guys next time